how to change interface appearance in Photoshop. That's what we're going to do in today's video. First, make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and write down below in the comments any suggestion or question that you have, and let's get started. So first, you have to open Photoshop. Once you open Photoshop, you have to go and open Preferences. Preferences in Windows are here in Edit. When you scroll down, and you find preferences option here and click on it but in mac you have to go to this photoshop label beside the apple icon click on it and go to preferences and then click on general you can also click on command k in order to open it then on the left yes you can see there are many sections to edit from for the preferences for today we need the interface click on interface and you can now change the color scheme from here as you can see you can change the appearance from here and the presentation from here and the option settings from here let's change the color theme as you can see it's been it's changing and this is the old photoshop theme we need the default you also can choose the highlight color you can change the colors from here for the standard screen mode full screen with menus full screen artboards you can choose for each one of these the color from here and the border style from here you can choose this from here as you can see, we can change the standard screen border, line or drop shadow or none, or we can choose the color, black, dark gray, medium gray, light gray, and the same for each option here. You can also change the UI language from here. If, it's, if your version supports this, you can change it from here, from the presentation section, and you can also choose to change the font size. Let's make this medium or small, but it tells you here that changes will take effect the next time you start Photoshop. So if we change this to medium, changes will be applied after I close Photoshop and open it. You can also change some of the settings here in the option. You can choose to show channels in color, dynamic color sliders, or to show menu colors. That's all for today. And that's how to change Photoshop interface. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and write down below in the comment section any suggestion or question that you have. And have a nice day.